Hey there storytellers, welcome back to my channel and welcome to day 70 of Book of Wayne. Today's video, as you can tell, is going to be another recommendation style video. For many such as myself, with Halloween comes Halloween candy and today I thought I'd pair up the perfect candy and book combo so that you have a Halloween snack to go with your Halloween read. So without any further ado, let's get right on into it. The first candy is Skittles and for this one I am matching up Carmilla. Both of these things are not as popular as they could be during spooky season and they're also a little fruity. The next candy is Airheads and for this I am matching it with Curse the Day. All of the different flavors of Airheads pair perfectly with the different flavors of the eccentric supernaturals of the town of Spellbound. Next we have Kit Kats and for this I am pairing it with Truly Devious. The two halves of one candy pair perfectly with the dual timeline of this awesome Dark Academia mystery. Next we have M&Ms and for this I am pairing it with really any collection of short spooky stories that you can go with. You know, H.P. Lovecraft collection, Edgar Allan Poe collection, a collection of a few different ones. You decide which collection is right for you. And because scary story collections are sort of great for mindless reading, going from story to story to story, the M&Ms pair perfectly for some mindless munching. Next we have York Mints and I am pairing this with Dracula. The dark chocolate and minty interior of the York Mint patties pair perfectly with Dracula's dark and chilly setting, especially at the castle. Next we have Buncher Crunch and I am pairing that with The Woman in Black. Both of these appear deceptively simple but are ultimately addicting. Next we have Candy Corn and I am pairing it with The City Baker's Guide to Country Living. They are both really super sweet, almost sickeningly so at times. They're not for everyone, but they're ultimately perfect for a select few. Next we have Milky Ways and I am pairing them with The Night Circus. The multiple layers of the candy pair perfectly with the multiple layers of this intricate story and both of them provide multiple levels of sensory experience. And last but not least, we have my personal favorite Halloween candy, Reese's, and I'm pairing this with Coraline. The candy's salty sweet combo pairs perfectly with the other mother's salty sweet personality. She starts out sweet, but when you dig a little bit deeper, it's not all fun and games. But that is it for this video. If you enjoyed it, let me know by leaving a like down below and let me know down in the comments what Halloween candy do you pair with certain books? What are your ultimate recommendations? I'm dying to find out. But for now, I'm going to get going. If you want to keep up with me and all of my bookish adventures, you can go ahead and click the subscribe button. And of course, I highly recommend that you ring the little bell so that you don't miss a beat because it will notify you every time I post a new video, which in the month of October is going to be every single day. So I'll see you guys tomorrow with a new one. Bye.